Welcome to my life on coasters where today I'm traveling from Japan in Belgium to London uh, Yeah, so if you haven't already go and check out my vlog to get here We use Flixbus which took the shuttle today we're using Flixbus which is taking a ferry uh, Yeah, so join me. Uh, I'm currently in Japan, which is a seaside town in Belgium um, I'm gonna hang about here for a couple of hours um, so I'll show you that um, yeah, then we're getting on a Flix bus, which is going to take us to Calais, hopefully, depending on uh, the weather, because it's windy today, uh, to Dover, and then that bus will take us to London. I'll show you our journey from London, um, yeah, out of London, because I don't live in London, I live sort of in Essex, so, uh, yeah, but the main sort of part of the travelling is to get to London. Uh, anyway, I won't ramble on, uh, we're just walking from our apartment um, to the tram station here in Japan. So after a seven minute walk from our apartment, I've made it down here to the tram stop. Just got to wait a couple of minutes and we'll get down towards Plops Land. So I've just got off the tram now by Plopsland. You can actually get a really good view of the park from here, just through this uh, gate there, as you can see. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, we're not actually going in here today. Uh, we've only got two hours, so getting a second day ticket wouldn't be worth it. Because it's like 40 euro, which is about 35 pounds. So, yeah, we're not doing that. Um, but anyway, you can get a really nice view of the ride to happiness in the daytime there. So, the last time then that I uh, talked to the camera, was at Japan. We've got on our Flix bus and made it onto the boat now. Um, yeah, as you can see, we're on the P&O ferry. Uh, yeah, it's the P&O Pioneer. I'm going to give you a full tour on that's what this video is really going to be. Because, um, yeah, the Flix bus, there's not much to show you. We just came through customs and that's it. I'll show you a bit of our journey from uh, Dover to London. But yeah, I'm going to give you a tour on the P&O Pioneer. So I'm starting here in the food market then. Uh, yeah, this is like a big place you can get all your food and stuff. Uh, you got like checkouts and stuff there. You got the sign. Uh, now I'll show you what there is and how much things are. Cereal and milk, two pound, uh, which isn't bad. You can get like uh, crisps and stuff, all your drinks. Mince pine hot drink, three ninety nine. Spicy Mexican uh, sandwiches and that. The price is like four ninety five, or you can get a meal deal for a nine quid. Uh, fruit pot, two pound fifty. Some stuff's pretty reasonable. Some's it's like one pound ten a bag of crisps. I get some slushies over here. I wonder how much these are. Uh, three pounds for well, reasonably sized one. Right, I head out of the food market now. The whole boat is basically a big lounge as well. Brand new boat, opened a few weeks or months ago, sorry. We've got the game zone in here. Do you like all your games? All of your toys and stuff. outdoor deck over there, I'll take you there in a bit. Uh, it's windy so I might not go outside much. Uh, duty free in there, looks absolutely humongous. Uh, we set sail in 10 minutes, so I'll see you then. Uh, deck nine up there, shorts up there. Oh, that's like your quiet lounge and stuff, and your pet lounge. More duty free, duty free takes up the end of the boat. Guest services. Currency exchange. Got lifts, parking is down below where you leave your car. Got a kids zone over here, I can't really show you much of that, but it's like a miniature soft play. Yeah, that's as much I'm going to show you of uh, the kids zone. Uh, just imagine like a little soft play and that just takes up that area. 
uh, yeah, outside deck. You've also got the lounge bar down the end, which you can get. It's like a cafe, and you can buy some alcohol there. So we just left uh, Calais then. You can see we're moving. Uh, it's so windy though. Uh, yeah, we've not left the harbour wall yet, so I'm a bit nervous to see how it's going to feel when we do. Uh, can't tell if this is the front or the back of the boat. Uh, well, obviously it's back, because, yeah, you can see behind us there. We're moving, we're moving a lot quicker than I thought boats did, but, uh, yeah. Uh, what time is it now? Yeah, yeah, we've been uh, sailing for a few minutes now. Scheduled to arrive for 20 UK time. I've obviously got time zone change, so yeah. I'll walk around here a bit, uh, this door's open. Oh. Yes. May I have your attention please? Our shop is now open, offering many reduced prices compared to the high street. Please be aware of the duty free allowance per person entering the UK is 24 litres of beer, 18 litres of wine, 4 litres of spirit or 9 litres of sparkling wine, 200 cigarettes or 250 grams of tobacco. Thank you for your attention and we wish you a pleasant crossing. Here we go then, we're just about to leave the harbour wall. Imagine it's going to feel a bit bumpy now. In duty free now. Mugs. Cadbury around here. Toblerone. Boys and games. Paddington stuff. Oh, Lego. Fourteen ninety nine, twenty pounds. Wow, duty free prices. Is there anything I actually want though? Ten pounds seventy nine. Yeah, I didn't know you could get Lego duty free. So that's pretty cool. Sixteen pound for the Ferrari. Might get one just to build. So I've showed you pretty much everything I can on the ferry. Uh, yeah, so really, I'll speak to you when we get to the other side. Unless I've missed anything, then I'll show you. So we're a third of the way into our sailing then. Uh, it's very windy and it's, uh, yeah, we're going up and down a bit. It's a very weird feeling for me as you're trying to walk and it just, you're moving. It's, I mean, it's interesting. How windy it is. It's more windy than a uh, but it's still quite choppy. But yeah, uh, the time now is 4.31. Uh, not 4.31, sorry, it's at 3.31, scheduled to arrive in about 55 minutes. Uh, so yeah, uh, I'm, we're not halfway yet, uh, though hopefully we're not far off. So we're uh, about 15 minutes um, away from Dover now. So I'm just going to have a look at deck nine now. Yeah, I didn't realise there's another deck, deck nine. Uh, so we go. Uh, oh, we've got a bit of club lounge, commercial drivers, the kitchen, pet lounge, and uh, yeah, right, let's go up. The stairs are weird. Wow. This is like the quiet bit up here. 
Oh, you can't go through there. Oh, that's commercial drivers. No wonder you can't. Yeah. Oh, wow. I didn't realise any of this was here. Uh, and we've only got, like, ten minutes till we get off. Oh, my God. We've missed all of the restaurant and that. I was looking for some food. Yeah. God, I can't believe we missed all this. Oh, there's an outside deck. Can we get to it at deck nine? No, can't. Unfortunately, no access to deck nine. Uh, outdoor bit, but that's understandable. Got stairs there. Quiet lounge. You can lay down in there. Uh, kind of wish I'd have gone in there, really. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, to comply with customs regulations, all gaming machines are about to be switched off. Please collect any winnings you may have and refrain from inserting any further monies as refunds cannot be given. Right, so we are in Dover now. Yeah, we've not come to a complete stop yet, um, but we nearly have. Uh, yeah, the call for everyone to get back to their bus has been made. Uh, so yeah, back in England. Uh, it's obviously not choppy at all now. We're just walking around normally. That's why I say if the wind's still bad here. I mean, it's a bit windy, but it's nothing too bad. Uh, if you're wondering why we're not going back to a bus yet, it's because there's a mad rush of people trying to get down the stairs and it's horrible. I don't want to uh, go and join this mad rush down a staircase because it's like everyone's trying to get down. Uh, so yeah, I don't fancy that very much. Anyway, Dover. I don't actually think I've ever even been to Dover. I've uh, been down this way though, which I don't think I've ever been to the town. Uh, anyway, right, let's get on our Flix bus unless we find uh, another thing to do. Because I don't unfortunately miss our bus and have to get the train directly home which would be such a uh, tragedy. Uh, you got white cliffs of Dover over there. So we've just been through, I believe it's customs to get into the UK now. Uh, yeah, we're just literally in Dover now. Um, yeah, I've no, no more security, no more nothing. Normal roads now. Uh, welcome to England. Uh, see, after this, we're getting back on our Flix bus, and that will take us to London Victoria Coach Station, where I'll see you when we get there. So, back at Victoria Station now, just walking from the coach to the tube station. Uh, yeah, I've got a bit of a about 20 minute walk or 15 minute walk from here. Um, yeah, Flix bus, we we're a bit late. We uh, ended up coming back about 40 minutes. Uh, later than planned, but uh, yeah, it's not too bad.